When I requested Washington, I was lucky enough to get to McCord Air Force Base and I retired here in 1979. I started, uh, got my license before I retired so that when, in 1980, when I was completely separated from the Air Force, I was ready to get into real estate. When I retired, not only did I get into real estate, but I, got so, I also got involved with the Hispanic community in Seattle because we were having a lot of problems with education and diversity and discrimination. So being that I had all that training and diversity in the military, it was a help to be involved with the Hispanic community. And as an activist in the state legislature and the cities and the counties, I was able to participate with the uh, older generation that had been fighting for civil rights issues. So we started the American GI Forum, which is the only congressional uh, veteran Hispanic veteran organization in the nation. What I enjoyed doing is teaching uh, the young people to teach their parents the real estate in Spanish, and then uh, the, par the young people can teach their parents in English. So it's a uh, continuing uh, to encourage our Spanish heritage and our Spanish language forward between the generations. Being in real estate and all the job knowledge I have, uh, I keep saying that I want to take it with me. I want to share it. So by sharing it, uh, real estate law, real estate financing, real estate, uh, to me, it helps the new agents succeed by helping them get started. And to me, it's like a family that you want to raise your children. To me, when I see young people, I want to share and encourage them to succeed. My name is Rafael Ojeda. I'm a managing broker with John L. Scott DuPont Office.